New information at noon. A judge has ruled that the state can seek the death penalty against Louis Toledo, the Deltona man accused of killing his wife and her two children. News 6 investigator Mike DeForest has been following this case closely. He joins us live at the Volusia County Courthouse. Mike. Well, starting Monday, the attorneys involved with this murder case will be traveling from uh, Volusia County here up to St. Augustine in St. John's County. The judge agreed to move this trial because of all the publicity here. But first, Luis Toledo was back in court today as his lawyers tried once again to get the death penalty taken off the table. This time they argued that due to a recent change in Florida's death penalty law, prosecutors did not file paperwork correctly when they first announced they were seeking capital punishment. But the judge ruled that the state can proceed with seeking the death penalty. Toledo is accused of murdering his wife, Yasina Suarez, and her two children back in 2013. Now, their bodies have never been found, but prosecutors say physical evidence and Toledo's own statements will show he murdered all three. Today, the judge ruled that prosecutors can tell jurors about a fight the couple allegedly had at their home just six days before Suarez disappeared. In that altercation, she was armed with an axe and Toledo had a knife, according to prosecutors. Now, jury selection is scheduled to begin Monday morning up in St. Augustine. Today, the judge ruled that those jurors will not be sequestered. They'll get to go home every day after trial. Reporting live in Volusia County, Mike DeForest, News 6. Thank you, Mike.